I'm sure you've seen it, Brett, but um, Ted Williams had a, a film out that I think he put it out in the uh, late sixties was just, you know, don't swing at pitches that you can't hit. And yeah, uh, Teddy, Teddy was, Teddy, obviously Teddy's one of the greatest hitters ever. Right. Yeah. I, I think I've seen that video. It's kind of funny. It, it know, is kind of funny. Like it's it's really, kind of, uh, it seems like it's really dated, doesn't it? When you it, it does. It, it does seem kind well, of like, and that's what, that's again, you can't, you can't judge players overall. I mean, it's not fair to put Ted Williams against Barry Bonds. Right. Sure, absolutely. It's a generational gap. You know, you got to compare players to their generation. So, so Ted Williams was the best hitter of his time, of his generation, of that thirty-year window. Ted Williams was far and away the best hitter. You know, you look yeah. at our era. My opinion, Barry Bonds is by far the best hitter and best hitter in the history of the game. Um, Couldn't agree more. It, and you can't, you really can't compare like a Ted or, or a or a Barry Bonds or a current modern day player to a Babe Ruth. It's just a different world. Sure. But the fact that Babe in his time was hitting more home runs than other entire teams shows you the dominance he had. Therefore, he's he's one of the greatest of all time. And I think you do that with every sport. You know, I don't think it's fair to compare LeBron James in his prime to somebody in the NBA that played in 1946. The physicality is too much. Right. But, but for that guy in 1946, if he was dominating his position at that time, he's one of the greatest ever. Absolutely. And I think you always got to do it. You got to put people in their spot. Who dominated their their era? And they, you put them up with the greatest. And then you move on to the next generation. Who's the best of this current generation? You know, is Mike Trout the best? Well, a lot of people say he is. So he's going to be one of the greatest players from this generation. And in 40 years, there's going to be a bunch of new guys. And, and you guys are going to be old. And you're going to be going, now. Nah, I was, you should have seen Griffey play and your grandkids. <laughs> you know, but that's the that's the coolness of, of – uh, getting a little older I, I you know i have arguments to this day with my dad he's still talking about the 70s phillies and i'm going dad those guys can't compete with the guys in my era <laughs> no yes they could you know and before my grandpa passed away we, we'd have arguments about mickey mantle and, and ted williams especially and i'd say gramps these guys can't hit you know these guys ted williams can't hit with this guy or this guy so that's fun to do and, and it's just you know comparing the generations